Yes then guys. Oh, two seconds. Oi. <laughs> oh, look a bit red tonight. Who have we got in the house today then? It's been a bit quiet today. With no tune sent in or nothing. And literally no one. No tunes to review today everyone. So it's gonna be a bit of a quick one today. Just thought I'd come on and do a quick update still. Um that's obviously yes. Lots of things to talk about. Obviously it's the birthday bash this weekend. Um I'm quite excited for that. Gonna be an interesting one. Um uh, give us a shout if you're coming along to that. I see it's in Ross on why so I'm not expecting loads of people to turn up. <laughs> it's only a little venue anyway. <clears throat> a little pub. Called King Charles II, ironically. Um, so yeah, me and Swanky going back to back for an hour and a half. It's going to be an interesting set. Evening, Brad. Nice to see you. I hope you enjoyed your one-to-one -one earlier. Brad is currently a student of mine, if anyone is there. Um, yeah, definitely quiet tonight. Don't know what's going on. Must be the solar eclipse. It's got to everyone's head. Yeah, on the belt. Um, so yeah, as for what I was talking about earlier, so <clears throat> obviously yeah, we've um been trying to get a house for ages. Um, <laughs> big up, mate. I'm glad you enjoyed it. I see you was taking notes as well. It's good. At least you can go back to it. I uh, should really um. Work out a way of like recording the videos while we're doing it so that I can always like send people the videos afterwards. That'd be handy. Hmm. I have to look into that. <clears throat> yeah, if everyone could give it a share. I don't know what, Facebook's like killing my reach or something at the moment. I don't know what's going on. Um. But yeah. I'm glad you enjoyed yourself, Brad. Obviously, yeah. So, like I said earlier in the video, um, We've got a house that we're moving into now, so we're going through loads of bits and bobs of it, but yeah, it's finally all come through today, that we've finally got it, it's all been confirmed, so we'll have, I'll have my own room to use as a studio, which shall be interesting, I've never had my own dedicated room for a studio, so I shall be hopefully documenting that and doing some videos on that as well, I'll give people an insight into what is going on. Um, obviously, yeah, gonna make it like a spare room type thing as well. Um, obviously, so people can come and stay over, so obviously, there'll be a big sofa there. So, we're gonna set it up so that the sofa can also be used as like a podcast space so we can finally have guests over and actually sit down and have proper interview style podcasts. That's gonna be good. And obviously, we can set the room up for exactly that. Um, so yeah, it's gonna be interesting. Obviously, if, Going forward, once we're all settled now, obviously I'll start getting some people involved, getting some people on. Um, so yeah, obviously that is good for YouTube and good for the music side of things. Obviously, yeah, birthday bash coming up this weekend. Make sure you um get on get on your tickets for that. But yeah, obviously due to current circumstances, in two weeks' time, obviously the podcast on the twenty third of April. Um, that will not be going ahead, obviously, we'll be uh, packing all our stuff up by that point, I'd imagine, so, I won't have a studio at this point, more than likely, so yeah, obviously once I get settled back in the new place and everything's all set up, um, then yeah, we'll be back on it properly, and hopefully in a nice new, good looking studio, so obviously, yeah, say goodbye to this background for the last time. Um, it was probably for the best, I was kind of while held off on the whole YouTube videos and stuff, and... Yeah, been a bit mm, slacking for the last few weeks, maybe. Um, yeah, so, yeah, a bit of a short one tonight, guys. Obviously, I haven't really got much else to talk about. Obviously, there is a fair few things to talk about, but we haven't got many viewers in tonight, so I don't want to be um, talking to myself if anyone's even still here. I'm guessing you're still here, Brad. It looks like you're the only one at the moment, bro. Yeah, very quiet. Everyone must be busy doing something. <laughs> um, so yeah, hopefully, we'll see. 
<laughs> you think you'd seen enough of my face today? <laughs> but there you go. Um, yeah, so obviously 23rd is going to be a no-go. Obviously then two weeks after that will be the 7th of May. Uh, so moving in there because that's all that week. And then, yeah, so I'm going to say 7th of May. We'll go with that. I reckon it'll give me enough time to get the studio set back up and everything. So, yeah, if not, obviously I'll issue an update and let you all know how everything is going. Um, but yeah, so not a massive one tonight, guys. Just a little quick update, basically, just to let you all know what's going on. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be a bit quiet over the next few weeks. Obviously, uh, my track <laughs> "Never Be the Same" is coming out very soon. Um, I'll just double check. Don't want to get the date wrong now, do we? Um, yeah, so it's like Del Vecchio's track, Middle of the Night, which is also a new banger. Maybe we could feature that, actually, yeah. We'll, we'll, um, we'll play that, Let's see what people think of that. Yes, then, Kitson. How we doing, bro? You've probably missed all of what I was just saying, but yeah, long and the short of it is, we've got a new house. Gonna have a fucking studio, like a whole room for a studio. So yeah, things are gonna change a lot. Gonna have a hopefully a big sofa in there, a place to do the actual interviews of everyone and get people down and stuff. So yeah, everything's gonna be taking a bit of a turn in the next few weeks. It's gonna be a bit quiet for me, but I won't go on about it too much again. But yeah, it's um gonna be interesting. So yeah, where was I? Mm. So yes, never be the same again. Obviously, yeah, we've got Sam I Am's track following me coming up on the 11th, so literally in two days. We're going to do a big post about that. Obviously, I actually quite like that. Very, very good um, free party hard trance. Um, yeah, man. It's obviously, a proper free party hard trance. So yeah, get yourselves on that one. Sam I Am's obviously been to me for a few lessons recently as well and it's nice to see it paying off in his music but yeah man okay so it's quite buzzing on my next side i'm having a having a bevy tonight actually i forgot about that what a rum and coke to celebrate <laughs> the missus is out tonight <coughs> yeah yeah the missus is out tonight she took the kid to her nan's house because they're staying there because it's near fort park because they're going to fort park tomorrow because it's obviously the holidays um and yeah, man, I played it a couple of weeks ago. Never be the same. Uh, actually, what you want about Sly's one? No, Sly's one was... Oh, which one I played is... Yeah, no... Uh, this is no game track. That's what I played the other week of his. But Sly's track... Um, I don't understand why we can't just go straight into it now. Bit of a different podcast tonight, guys. <laughs> At least you're here, Kitson. Nice to see you're here. Well, at least a few people have turned up. Um, two seconds. Hopefully it works. Obviously I was changing around all my um, <laughs> all my settings earlier to do the one to one with Brad. Let's have a little chat. Yeah, we've got some we've got some volume coming in. Yeah, this is Sly's latest release. Obviously there's a preview up on SoundCloud, but this is the actual track. Yeah, Sly's fucking smashing it at the moment. Fair play to him, though. This is a bit, uh, this is a bit more of like a commercial type one, but I love it. Kind of re reminiscent of Calvin Harris's recent stuff. Yeah, it's not so, not so much in your face. This one, it's quite nice. It's a more melodic, musical vibe to it. I like it. Obviously, it was my master. He let me take the reins on this one this time.
<laughs> yeah, I've always wanted that. I'm sure it's Splice. Everyone's on the Splice thing at the moment. It's got to have a good look for Splice. You find some good, good vocals in there. That's what I found on mine. And nice tune. Oh. That's probably why it's so quiet. Yeah, this is a nice breakdown here as well. He's done well with this, yeah. He's, he's, it's nice to see how versatile of a producer he is. Oh, he just released a 175 beats per minute belter or waxer and then he's and then made this like so it's nice to see the versatility. Big up Sly if you're listening. That's definitely 90s vibes. Oh, four people in the house now. Come on, everyone. Been a slow one tonight. Rapture radio incoming. <laughs> Maybe that should be a thing. Rapture radio. Anyone be up for doing sets on that? Hehe. <laughs> And here we go. This this is the big bit. Come on, everyone, get sharing it. Let's go. I'm on my own tonight, so more people the better. <laughs> This is alright, this one. Right. Right. Yeah, big up, big up for Sly on that one. I've got another one that I would be um, keen to showcase to actually. So, obviously, we started, well, I've started using this label radar service. I don't know if anyone's, anyone's heard of that. Um, but it's like a... Do, 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 uh, just don't know how to describe it. It's like a... Um, like a service, I guess, where you upload your tunes to, and obviously there's labels on there, and then there's so the artists on there, and then the labels can go on there, look for all the submissions and see all the stuff that's on there. Or if you're an artist, you can go on there and submit to all the labels or submit to specific labels. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I've... Um, I had a little dab with it and obviously set up Rapture's profile and yeah, we ended up finding this track. It is coming out for summer. Definitely quite a summery vibe. I've played it to a few people now actually and it gets quite a good reaction. Got an interesting start. Let's just wait till it drops. Oh, pardon me. Give it a chance. I was blown away by it to be honest. I wasn't expecting it either. <laughs> Chris Kent music. Go check him out. Usually make house music and that. Well, experimented with this and this is how it turned out. Fair play to him. Uh, 
I'll probably enjoy this one. Stop looking to your future and looking at your goals. Trying to be somebody, trying to find your soul. It's important for you to know. nice to hear a different drop when it eventually comes around rolling Nice, yeah, Chris Kemp music. Go check him out. But yeah, um, that's gonna be pretty much it for tonight, guys. Not um, not had any submissions this week. Can you believe it? Literally no one. So, oh, I haven't got really many new tunes to share at the moment. Obviously, I've been. Busy sorting my life out recently. Obviously, need to purchase Fruit Loops as well. I need to get a license for that. So yeah, everything's gonna be a bit up in the air at the moment for the next few weeks. But <coughs> it's not out yet, mate. It's um becoming ooh mid May, I believe. Uh, no, end of May. Sorry, end of May. It'll be out. Obviously. I'm trying to get him to do us an extended mix as well, so we can do a proper release of it. I think it's got potential. Um, so yeah, obviously we'll uh, hook all you guys up with a copy of it once I've got it all sorted. But yeah, other than that, guys, big up for the people that did tune in tonight. Oh mate, I'll have some tunes for your kits, and I'll send you some over. I'll um get some of my latest ones up together and get them over to you. So I've got a few bits and bobs, but like I said, I'm a bit of out, out of action at the moment. The old music production side of things, obviously, definitely now that we're moving as well. So, yeah, I'll be packing everything away soon and saying goodbye to it for a bit. So, yeah, once it's all moved and reset up and I've got Fruity Loop sorted, then, yeah, I'll be back on it and raring to go. So, yeah, until then, guys, peace out. And obviously, like I said to you, Kitson... Obviously, I'll update you as well. 23rd of April, I won't be able to obviously do a podcast. Obviously, we'll be busy packing everything up by then. Um, so, yeah. Hopefully, we'll see you on the 7th of May. If not, I'll update you and let you know. But, yeah, I'd like to think I'll have enough time. It's like... Near on... A week and a half to sort my life out and get the studio set up again. So, yeah, we'll, we'll see. Peace out, guys. See you all soon. Hurrah.